Welcome to Card Corner. These are the cards. That's the corner. Today we're going to be opening these. They're Animal Crossing trading cards. It's for our day four of our advent calendar. Thanks to uh, Mrs. Corner for hooking us up. I got a little bit different setup because these ones are in Japanese. So I've got the translator hooked up here. Oh, Animal Crossing. There we go. Kind of works. Cards. Oh, so they're for sale and use in Japan only, so going off the rails here. These are uh, e-reader cards. You could, I think, use this like scanner software to put the characters in your game. And it comes with a bonus card. We got it's like a Santa reindeer guy. Jingle. So let's try it out. Her eyes are kind of sparkling, and it's refreshing to the point where it's unpleasant. Such people often cannot see their surroundings. Even though I just changed my clothes, I mistakenly thought it was a different person. Favorite words. If you hurry, turn around. All right, so I'm not super sure if that... Uh, Makes sense, but it's better than nothing. All right, opening the pack. It's the instruction manual. I guess this is to show you how to scan the cards into the e-reader. Thank you for raising it. Makes sense sometimes, I guess. So I think that the cards that we want to get are like Tom Nook, obviously. Let's see if we can get this to work or not. <laughs> it was working there for a sec. It seems that it was 100% wool, but it's hard in the summer. No, it doesn't look like he's doing that much, but it's more unbearable to watch him. Cabraba. This is what it looks like in the original. Next we got Dabutsu no Mori. I remember this guy, it was kind of like their version of the stock market. You could like buy turnips from him and then maybe they'd increase in value, maybe not. Peddler who sells turnips every Sunday. Oh, come on. If you go back in time, your turnips will rot immediately, and going to a village whose time is out of sync with yours will have the same result, so be careful. It's like an anti-cheating measure, I guess. All right, next I've got, who's this? Barico. It doesn't matter if, even if it's small, I'd like a house with a garden. I'll make a flower bed and make a lot of cute flowers bloom. I want to feed my husband delicious homemade food every day. Donna Sama's annual income, 80 million bells is enough. 
Perico. It's a Pisces. All right, it's kind of working. That's kind of fun. Got like a dog guy here, John. All right, let's see if it'll translate. It's kind of high spirited, but it's not scary at all. I mean, your name is John, right? Loyalty, even when you sleep. It's John. So if you want to trade me for John or this pelican, then the instructions for how to do that are on the about page for my YouTube channel. That'd be cool if you wanted to do that. I don't have this scanner, but I think that they're still cool because I did play this Animal Crossing game on GameCube, though it was in English. And of course the Switch version that was mega popular. Do you know dumbbells? Heavy ones that train muscles. There's one that's made out of something like plas that plastic and you fill it with water and use it. That's convenient, isn't it? Oh, lost it. Dumbbell. He's the workout gorilla. All right, one more. It is... on all right not working for this one so well mohair it seems that it was 100 wool but it's hard in the summer oh yeah we did this guy already all right so those are the animal crossing cards i think that uh it was fun to translate all the names in the descriptions, I might try to break this out when I do more sumo wrestling so we can read the different uh, descriptions on those cards. Anyway, thanks again to Mrs. Corner for hooking us up with these Animal Crossing cards. And uh, see you next time.